in recognition of those who serve and protect it, we ask that everyone please rise, remove all headwear, and turn your attention to the stars and stripes, and join us in the singing of our national anthem as performed tonight by Grace Nelson. marching off the floor. And we are ready to go. Give the starting lineup. Gracie Nelson, the uh, singer there. Very nice job. All right, fans, let's meet tonight's starting lineup. Both teams will begin first. All right, let's go uh, with the uh, starting lineup uh, for the visitors from uh, Moorhead State. Really, uh, uh, quite possibly the very best uh, women's team in the league. In fact, I don't, think, uh, I don't think there's any doubt of that. Moorhead State coming in at 17 and 3, 13 and 1 in conference play. And uh, they, of course, uh, are leading the Northern Division. They're leading the entire league, North and South Division as well. So it'll be a firm test uh, for Minnesota State uh, this evening. Mavericks uh, winning it. Wayne State last weekend, and of course uh, coming up with a tremendous performance against Augustana, really controlling the ball game uh, last uh, Sunday for 95% of the game. But in the end, of course, uh, teams have to finish games. That's the important thing, and uh, the Mavericks just couldn't do it. Give you the starting lineup here uh, for uh, the Moorhead State uh, Dragons. It'll be Lauren Fetch, 5'8", sophomore guard, number 10. Number 12 is Jackie Volker. She is a 5'7", senior guard. Number 24 is Kylie Barovitz. She is 5'8", a sophomore guard. 6'2", junior forward post, Maddie Green. Number 40. And number 51, Megan Hintz, 6'2", senior forward. And she wears, uh, again, number 51, Megan Hintz, one of their uh, leading scorers. Leading scorer is, uh, for the most part, in uh, most ball games, Kylie Barovitz. Almost 15 a game. Averages almost five uh, rebounds a game as well. So, good uh, Solid basketball team here for Moorhead State, coached by Carla Nelson. For the Mavericks, 5'9 uh, senior guard, Monica Muth, number three. Number four, 5'9 sophomore guard, Kristen Klitsky. Uh, number 30 is Taylor Drost. And uh, it'll be Shumsky jumping and not controlling it. I think she might have got a hand on it first, but Moorhead State to controlling the tap. Taylor Drost, Brooke Tonsfeld, Rachel Shumsky, the other starter. Shot missed from the right side, rebounded by Drost. Drost driving down to the baseline, hitting about a 13-footer on the left side. 
So, Drost uh, gets the uh, first two of the evening. Robbins, left side. Robbins uh, over on the left side. Uh, ball knocked away by Muth and then uh, picked up by uh, over and back as Volkert uh, just could not save it in uh, time. So here you go with uh, Monica Muth coming to the point, getting a, p a t uh, pick from uh, Shumsky. Goes back to Shumsky to Drost at the point, and she hits a three-pointer. So Drost with a two and a three to start the scoring here for Minnesota State. Much improved basketball team for the Mavericks. No question about that. Barabic over on the left side gets it deeper on the left side to fetch. Back to Barabic over here on the right side to Green. Green into the circle now on the right side to Volkert. Volkert underneath loose ball knocked away from uh, Hintz. Picked up by the Mavericks. Here's Muth with it coming up court. 5 nothing Mavericks here as we start. Here's Muth. Back out front it goes. And Drost again, this time uh, off the front rim, not good. And the rebound taken by Hintz. Over on the right side, uh, deep in the right corner, goes to Fetch. Fetch uh, comes out to the point, stops at the point. Now uh, keeps that dribble alive and goes to the right side. Deep into the corner to Volker. Volker uh, walked. So... It will belong uh, to the Mavericks. Out front, Tonsfeld, left side, Klitsky, Shumsky at the point, left side, Drost. Drost for three, hits it. Drost, eight, Moorhead State, nothing. 7.37 to play here in the first quarter. Fetch goes over to the left side and loses the basketball, but it's knocked away by Minnesota State, last touched by Minnesota State. So on the far side of the court, Barabitz uh, will uh, toss it in for the Dragons. Give it up to Fetch, goes to the right side. Outside, three-point attempt by Hintz, not good. She follows the shot, almost gets it, but Klitsky gets the rebound. Over on the left side, Tonsfeld, quick shot. Mavericks taking uh, a couple of quick shots here. Probably should wait a bit and do the best they can with maybe four or five passes. But sometimes uh, young people don't listen to their coach. <laughs> that goes for the old people too. <laughs> Driving down the right side of the line, banging it off the glass is green and we have a whistle. <laughs> And the foul is going to go against Klitsky. Klitsky with the first uh, foul of the ball game. It is Volkert now over swinging the ball around to the right side. The three-point shot by Green, not good. And the rebound, loose ball coming up with uh, Drost. Stops, Klitsky over in the left corner. Tonsfeld, Tonsfeld beyond the arc looking inside. Comes back to the uh, lane, has the ball hacked away from behind. Might be Barabitz with the foul. We'll see. Wait for the signal. No, it's not. It's going to be Fetch. Fetch with the foul. Fenster, Menster rather, and Stutley in the lineup for Minnesota State. In the lane, Drost, the uh, spin move, baby hook, not good, but she was fouled. 
And it's going to go against uh, to uh, we have a new person there. Boom. <laughs> Boom with the foul. Six foot uh, Richard freshman post Peyton Boom. She commits the foul. First free throw, good by Drost. Second shot up, good by Drost. Drost has all the points so far. 10 nothing in favor of uh, Minnesota State. All right, 6.22 remaining here in the uh, first quarter. Driving is uh, Boom, and Boom lays it up. Not good, but I believe she was fouled as well. Nope, just knocked out of bounds. It'll go right back to uh, Moorhead State. Minnesota State Moorhead, to be correct. This uh, is uh, the Dragons. Baravitz driving to the right side. Not good. Put up and in, though, by Hintz. Hintz scoring. First bucket coming uh, at the six-minute mark of the first quarter for the Dragons. Stutley driving hard off the glass, not good. The rebound on the other side, uh, taken down by Boom. Has it out front, then gives it over to uh, Volkert. Volkert, uh, Baravitz back out front. And three-point attempt up, not good by Legal. Legal misses it. And it'll go out of bounds to Minnesota State. With the basketball, Minster, Riley Minster coming up court with it. Bounce pass, high post, Shumsky. Shumsky looks to pass down low to Muth, gets to the baseline, then backs up on the dribble, looks out front. Now Minster, now Stutley underneath. Shumsky fakes once, puts it up, not good, gets her own rebound, back to the hoop on the left side, that won't go. And uh, loose ball picked up by Moorhead State. Baravitz has it, comes straight up the court, goes to the right side, over in the corner to Volkert. Volkert underneath, uh, I think that was Hins. No, it wasn't. It was Boom. And then uh, underneath, Boom, uh, turnaround jump, uh, hook, not good. Out of bounds to Minnesota State. Green will re enter the ball game. And Boom will uh, come out. There might be some other changes too, but we have a timeout, so we'll be back after this. Time back in. And Metzger will bring it up for Minnesota State. Gross stays in. Shumsky stays in. Stutley stays in. Over the right side, Klitsky picks up the uh, rolling basketball and get kicked, I think. Klitsky drives the right side and lays it up and in. Klitsky scoring. And that makes it 12-2. Uh, to two. Mavericks off to a tremendous start. Roberts way outside. She was practically sitting on the Maverick bench when she niftily put that one in. 5'8 sophomore guard. Roberts, uh, by the way, is uh, from uh, Rozo, Minnesota, hockey town. That one uh, is missed for Minnesota State. Up ahead it goes. Legal for three. That's not good. Goes out of bounds. And it was last touched, I think, by uh, Nicole Brown of uh, Minnesota State Moorhead. So, 
Here we go with Klitschke coming up uh, court with it. She is from Montrose, Minnesota. Down low it goes off the glass. Not good by Christy Fett, who just entered the ball game during that uh, last time out. Out front with it is uh, Volkert. Then outside, Barabitz again with a long three, about five feet beyond the arc, but the ball is uh, put up and in by Green. 6-2 junior forward post, Matty Green makes it. Bounce pan down low to uh, Grost, and she hits it on the baseline, about a 10-footer. Drost is uh, over her average right now. 14 to seven, Minnesota State leading by seven. Stop and go, Volker drives, whips it over the corner on the left side, a three-pointer, not good by Legal, and uh, rebound comes down to Menster. Menster with it, outside, gets a return pass, hits a three. Riley Menster for three. Riley's from Springville, Iowa. Over on the left side with it is Green. Deeper on the left side, it goes to uh, Legal. Then underneath, uh, putting up a sort of a modified hook shot is Green. Doesn't go, goes out of bounds to Minnesota State Moorhead. Uh, in the lineup, Nicole Herbrinson. And baseline right. Coming up, goes in to Volkert over there on the right wing beyond the arc. <laughs> she gets it to Hintz. Hintz pops it over on the left side to uh, Herbranson, who just came in. Then back, uh, going across the lane with a, a little baby hook shot. Not good for Green. And the Mavericks have it. Klitsky weaving her way to the basket, puts it up, not good. Rebound uh, comes down to Hintz. Hintz clears it away, gets it up court to Volkert. Volkert bounce pass out front to Hintz. Hintz for the basket, underhand layup, not good. And the rebound taken by Tonsfeld. Tonsfeld with it. Almost loses it, regains it. Klitsky, left elbow, stop and go, gets in. Underhand pass knocked away, out of bounds. It goes to Minnesota State Moorhead. Last touched, I believe, by Fett. Christy Fett, 6'5", freshman post out of Glenville, Minnesota. 17-7, Mavericks by 10 with the 128 remaining in the first quarter. Driving Volkert, little runner, not good. Stutley with a rebound for Minnesota State. Klitsky. Klitsky has it. Tonsfeld, left wing, way, way out, about uh, eight feet beyond the arc. Tonsfeld drives into the lane. We have a push on Volkert, I believe. We'll see. That's who it is. Basketball Drost over on the left baseline, then out front to Klitsky for three, and that goes out of bounds. So first quarter, the Mavericks uh, leading it by 10 with 58 seconds remaining in the first quarter. Over on the right side, Herbranson. Not it. I believe that was Hintz. She handled it for a moment, then whipped it out of the corner to Fetch. She misses a three, and here's Drost with it, gives it off to Klitsky. 34 seconds remaining in the first quarter. Mavericks lead it by 10. Good shot here, young ladies. Good shot. Klitsky backs up on the dribble. 13 seconds on the shot clock. 20 seconds on the game clock. First quarter coming to an end. The Mavericks leading by 10. Drost has it over the right side. Klitsky gets to the elbow on the right side. Drives all the way underneath. Fakes, shoots, and fouled by Hintz.
Shot is up, good by Klitsky. And the Montrose native makes the first one. Let's see if she can get the second one. It's been pretty much uh, first quarter by Drost. Second shot up, high off the rim, not good. Rebound taken by Hintz. Knocked away by Tonsfeld, but uh, picked up by Fetch. She fetched it and then up ahead to Hintz. Hintz with a long three at the buzzer, not good. First quarter goes to the Mavericks, 18 to seven. We'll take a break. except for Drost, who is four for five. <laughs> and uh, she, of course, came up with uh, 12 in that uh, first quarter. Three for Kirsten Klitsky, three for Riley Minster. That was it. So it's a pretty good quarter, quarter by Drost. Tonsfeld drives to the baseline, whips up um, a baby hook. It's not good. Fed almost was able to put it in, and uh, up in it goes to Volker. Volker out front to Hintz. Baravitz takes it to the right baseline, comes back out front. Jumper on the way, pull up jumper off the glass, and good by Maddie Green. That was a very nice shot. She has four. Moorhead uh, shooting just 16.7% uh, in that first uh, quarter of play. The Mavericks uh, leading it 18 to seven at that time. And there's Drost again. In the lane about a 13 footer. Head on the basket, good. All right, out front with an off her shoe. And that's going to be a fetch. Lauren Fetch, by the way, from uh, Wausau, Wisconsin. Little insurance company there in Wausau. It's eh, rather famous. 20 to 9, Minnesota State with 849 to play. Well, believe me. Minnesota State Moorhead does not look like the most powerful team on the court tonight. They uh, have been 17 times this season. 13 in the conference, they're 13 and 1. The Mavericks on the other hand, 7 and 11 overall, and 4 and 10 in the conference. But the last uh, four games, they've been playing extremely well. Muth spinning to the basket and loses it. I thought maybe Fetch got a hand in there, but not true. Let's see if we have any other scores here to give you. Track scores all over the place here. Uh, off the glass, not good. We have a whistle and a foul is going to go against Fink. And to the line will be Hints. Right, Got to find the uh, women's basketball schedule. We got softball. Mavericks went one and one today. Shot is up and Hints rolls it in. Come on, we're, here we are. I don't know why they don't have this set up for uh, women's basketball right next to men's basketball, but they do not. Hints. And I, I will not say who they is. But perhaps better is who they are. But it's just one. <laughs> Out of bounds it goes, and uh, for Minnesota State, they will pass it in baseline left, and that'll be Monica Muth from Cambridge, Wisconsin. Looking, gets it into Klitsky. Klitsky over Drost, left elbow, shot is up and good. Drost is, I believe, six for seven. Uh, that's not bad, not bad shooting at all. She has 16. 
Hot side with a basketball. Fetch. Fetch over the left side goes to uh, Volkert. Volkert to the right elbow. Well, actually, so that should be a three-pointer. Lined up with the right elbow, but about five feet beyond it. So Volkert gets in the scoring column. Muth has it. Right side, Drost. Drost open for the three and hits it. You know, I hate to say she's feeling it, but, uh, you know, it's such a hackneyed expression. But it's true. <laughs> she is. She's missed one shot. She has 19. Steal by Tansfield. Tansfield, by the way, from Moorhead. 26 to 14. Volkert goes to the right corner. Backs out of there. Takes a quick three. Not good. Rebound. Muth. Uh, and she is fouled by Barabic. So let's see. Shumsky, Tansfeld, Minster, Muth, and Drost. 19 now for Drost. We're only in the second quarter of 641 to play. She had 12 in the first. Here's Muth. Tonsfeld right down the lane. Running hook. Hammocks are really shooting quite well. It's almost ridiculous the way they're shooting. Stop and go, Volkert uh, out front. Bounce pass on the baseline, uh, underneath, laying it up and in. That's uh, Herbertson. Or uh, Branson, I believe. Right corner, Minster, then comes to the point, to the uh, wing. Bounce pass down low, and Shepsky rolls one across the rim. Not good, and the rebound, Volkert, long pass up ahead. Herbranson driving, lays it up, not good. Rebound, Shepsky. Muth, up the court with it. Stops at the point, bounce pass. Drost, the runner in the lane, rolls off. Second miss, but she has 19 points. From outside, Barabic, not good. Rebound, Drost, long rebound. Up to, uh, about 12 feet away from the basket. Muth. I think, um, I think Trost needs, needs a little rest there. <laughs> She's been just absolutely up and down the court like crazy. Nice pass by Trost. Threading the net. Goes to Tonsville. She lays it in. 30 to 16, Minnesota State with 4.56 to play. Volker, right side. Herbrinson over on the left side. Barabitz, Barabitz to the baseline. Spins, goes to the hoop with a little runner, not good. Gets her own rebound off the glass and good. Barabitz, 15 points per game. Shows you why there. Muth brings it up. Out front, Menster. Menster right down the lane, off the glass, and good. Hesitated just a little bit at the end of the shot. And I think confounded the defensive player with that little move. Over on the left side, Barabitz for three, in and out, not good. Rebound battle for Muth comes up with it. Outlet pass to Tonsfield, stolen away. Herbranson over to Barabitz, spins in on the basket again, off the glass and good. She is strong. Barabitz, 5'8", sophomore guard. Yeah, Barabitz, uh, Kylie Barabitz from Rozo. And Menster with the underhand scoop. Not good going across the lane, but she's fouled. And it's going to go against her Branson. Number one on Nicole. Her Branson, uh, by the way, is from uh, Rolog, Minnesota. Big threshing bee uh, celebration there in the summer. One of the biggest. Probably not quite as big as, uh, maybe it is as big as the uh, Butterfield Threshermen's Association threshing bee. Timeout on the court, 3.46 to play. First half, Mavericks lead it by 12, 32 to 20. Back in a bit. Thank 
you. Well, let's take a look at uh, some of the scores here. UMD 43-32 over Winona State. 116 remaining in the half. Sioux Falls 35-16 over Bemidji State. 450 remaining in the half. Wayne State trailing uh, the University of Mary 29-19, 6-26 remaining in the game. Uh, Concordia St. Paul 34-17 over Northern, tomorrow's opponent. 223 remaining in that ball game. Upper Iowa trailing St. Cloud 35-16, 4-14 remaining. Menster at the line, the shot is up, uh, rolls and goes. Went about three feet uh, above the basket, then came down. Riley Menster, really a good young player from Springville, Iowa. Second shot up and good by Menster. Crexton trailing by five against Southwest Minnesota, 158 remaining in the first half. All right, out front, Barabitz has it. Rolling back and forth uh, over on the left side. Down low, knocked away. Scramble on the floor. Stutley comes up with it. Gets it to Shumsky after it was knocked away by Ashley Reed. Timeout called by Minnesota State. We'll take a break. 50% uh, from outside, three for six for Minnesota State. From the free throw line, 75% on three for four. 28.6 shooting for the Dragons. Muth brings it up. Bounce pass on the right side. Menster. Menster looks inside out front. Shubsky. Shubsky. Oh, beautiful pass underneath. Stutley can't get it. But the rebound is taken by Ashley Reed, the 6'2 senior forward. She was fouled by Roberts. Her second. Third team foul on the Dragons. By the way, Ashley Reed from Whitefish Bay, Wisconsin, 6'2", senior. Spin move in the lane, stop me! Oh, 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 36-20, Mavericks by 16. In the lane, little jump hook, very nicely done by Green. Waited as long as she could and put it up and in. Metzger, right wing. Out front, Ashley Reed. Stutley, left wing. Beautiful pass underneath to Metzger, and uh, Riley cannot make it go. Stutley, by the way, from Mount Alaska, Wisconsin. Stutley is 5'10", a sophomore forward. And when she comes into the ball game, she goes to work right away. From the corner, and Herbranson, not good. That was a three-point attempt, and Ashley Reed, quickly, her second rebound. She brings it up the right side, stops, loops it over here to Muth. With the basketball, Muth goes to the right wing with it, stops. Out front, Stutley driving right to the hoop. No basket. Foul on the court. Green. Go against Green. That's her first. That would be, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, team foul. Goes into Muth, gets loose underneath, and she is fouled by Green. Green with her uh, second foul. Youth, Cambridge, Wisconsin. Shot is up and rolls off. Not good. Youth is the second leading scorer for the Mavericks. She has not scored tonight, however. MJ Wagenson, Erica Parker, and uh, April Cabas, the officials for tonight's game. Second free, throw. Second free throw not good by Muth. That's a rarity. 
The officials for uh, the men's game will be uh, Doug Vitale, Tommy Maurer, and Ted Kreis. So Volker over in the right corner with it. Now Hintz, now the left side, Herb Branson. Three-pointer good. And he did that one. 5'9 freshman guard, Nicole Herbranson. 36-25, 11-point lead. 1.20 to play in the first half. Minnesota State on top. Stutler! She has four. The Mavericks lead it by 13 big ones. Took uh, Boyd State. There's a pass inside off the glass. Not good by Brown. That is uh, Brooklyn, uh, uh, no, pardon me, uh, Nicole Brown. They do have a young player with uh, the name of uh, Brooklyn Legal. Does sound like a law firm in a way. Jumper not good for Minnesota State. Here's Volker coming up, goes to the uh, right corner with it, looks inside, ball knocked away by Minster, out of bounds to the Dragons. Tonsfeld back in for the Dragons. 27.9 remaining in this first half. And the Mavericks with a very nice uh, lead. Metzer knocks it away on the inbound pass. Herb Branson, the freshman from uh, Minnesota State Moorhead will uh, pass it in. Almost intercepted by Metzger. Volker goes to the left wing. Looks, gives it up. Driving to the right side. Knocked away by one of the Mavericks and picked up by Tonsfeld. Goes all the way. Goes in. Tonsfeld has eight.
obviously it's going to be a key for us. We've been in some close games lately, so we got to figure out a way to kind of uh, just be consistent, but be consistent with a lot of energy and a lot of uh, a lot of effort out there. Well, I think this is the fourth game in a row that the Mavericks have been as good as any team in the league. Yeah, we I, again we feel good about how we've been playing as as a group, but you know the win loss record maybe doesn't show it. But hopefully, um, you know this was a good first half, but it's it's just a, another step. So hopefully we can uh, be better here in the second half. We'll All see right. what we can do. Thanks, Amy. Yeah, thanks, Case. We go the 2008-2009 NCAA Division II National Champions. That was fun seeing them again. All of them. All right. Men's game uh, coming up at approximately 7.30 this evening. Two uh, very, very good teams. Uh, Mavericks coming in uh, tied for first in the Southern Division at 10-4 and four with Wayne State. And uh, <clears throat> the Dragons on the other hand, a couple of games behind uh, Northern State. There's a nice drive to the basket, but rolling it off the rim is hints. But anyway, uh, Minnesota State uh, tied for first in the Southern Division. And uh, Moore had a couple of games behind Northern State in. There's a three-pointer up and good in the Northern Division. Three-pointer up and good by Muth as she scores her first uh, three of the ball game, first points of the ball game. Underneath on the right side, Hins can't get it to go on the right side, gets a rebound on the left block, comes back out front. Herbranson, that freshman starting the uh, second half, she played a lot in the first half and played well. Puts it up from the right baseline, not good. Tonsfeld the rebound, clears it away to Muth. Long pass ahead to Klitsky. Klitsky stops. And she was stopping for a reason. She was fouled. Or wait a minute, wait a minute. No, that's a uh, possession error is going to go to the uh, Mavericks. Baseline right. Get it in Tonsfeld. Underneath, lays it up and in. The Mavericks extremely aggressive offensively and defensively tonight. 45-25, 20-point lead for the Mavericks. They've scored the first five points of this half. There's a drive. Not good by Minnesota State Moorhead. Uh, That'll be Maddie Green, and the foul is going to go on Minnesota State's Shumsky. And that would be her first, uh, second shot up, and good for Maddie Green. So missed the first one, but uh, got the second one to go. All right, Mavericks have it. Reach in out front on Volkert. 8.27 remaining in the ball game. 45-26, Minnesota State on top. Muth has it. Comes to the right side, Tonsfeld behind the arc. Back over to Muth in the corner. Three-point attempt, not there. Shumsky with a rebound. She was sandwiched in between a couple of uh, Minnesota State Moorhead players. And one of the Dragons is going to be guilty of a personal, and that will be Green. That's her third. 45-26. Green comes out with her third foul. Baseline left, Muth gets it in the Drost. Drost at 18 in the first half. And from the elbow, not good. And the rebound is taken down by Hins and uh, get it, uh, gets it out to Volkert. Now Hins at the point on the left side. Roberts jumper on the way, high off the rim from the left elbow, not good. Rebound in the corner. Goes to Herbranson. Now Volkert. Volkert gets inside the arc, puts one up from 17, not there. Rebound Tonsfeld and Hins. They tie up this time the possession arrow. Will go in favor of the Dragons. Clad in uh, red tonight. Jump ball. With uh, white trim, red shoes. Mavericks in uh, home whites. Well, that isn't always the case anymore. Underneath the Hins, partially blocked by Shumsky. Tonsfeld is fouled by 
Boom. I think it was, yeah. It's her third. Monica Muth coming up court with it, stops on the right wing, backs up on the dribble, looks over to the right side. Comes to the right wing. Now Shumsky. Now Drost from outside. Three-pointer. Good. Drost now with 22. I think they might have revised that. Her point total, that is. It was 19 at one time. Then they uh, erased that and made it 18. Now it's, uh, I think it's where it should be at 22 with that last three. Rebound, Tonsfeld. Tough rebound, too, and the miss by the Dragons. Up ahead, Dros fakes left, drives right. And the stop and go works as she lays it in on the jumper, pull up jumper from the right. And she's fouled. On the Dragons, boom, and it'll go against Boom again, and that is her fourth. I think Boom was the. Uh, First one off the bench for the Dragons in the first half, and she's picked up her fourth foul. Now coming in, it'll be Steichen. Natalie Steichen moving into the lineup. And Drost at the line looking for the three-point play, and she gets it. 23 now for Drost. Out front, Steichen with it. Over on the right side, it goes back to Steichen from, I think, uh, who was that that just came in? It was uh, Jesse Bird. And the jumper up and good. That's going to go to uh, Volker. Two-pointer. She has five. 51 to 29, Minnesota State with 627 to play in the third. There's a jump stop by Muth, and she's short with it. Turns around, looks at herself in the mirror. <laughs> no. She had a look at her face like, how did I miss that? I have to say the same thing. Beautiful move to get open, but two feet away from the basket, and she couldn't get it to go. There is a push on the inbound pass. Shumsky was fouled by Hintz. That is her second. And it'll be baseline uh, left. Oh, wait a minute. They're going to, they were lined up to inbound it, but the foul was on the shot. So Shumsky will go to the line for two. Shot is up, not good. Shumsky has not scored tonight. Has she? No. That's a rarity. 15 team. Second shot up by Shumsky. There, she's in the uh, scoring stats now. Let's see, how many rebounds does she have? Ball knocked away right to our left here. And it will go right back to uh, Minnesota State Moorhead. Shumsky with uh, three rebounds tonight. She's had a number of double-doubles uh, so far this season. <clears throat> Pass goes in. To the corner, Baravitz for three. Baravitz now with a total of 10. Baravitz with 10. Muth down the lane. Jumper in the corner, in and out. Halfway down by Shumsky, about 14 feet away. Ball knocked away by Drost on the score, on the floor for it, and Shumsky picks it up. Gives it over to Klitsky. Klitsky comes to the right side, goes to the point, goes to the left wing, hands it off. No, she's not going to hand it off to Muth. Now she does. Muth has it, left wing, coming to the point. Over in the left corner, Klitsky. Klitsky looks in, passes down low to Tonsfeld, and Tonsfeld, I believe, is fouled. Fifty-two to thirty-two, twenty-point lead for Minnesota State. Baravich with the uh, foul. That's her third. Coming back into the ball game will be uh, Lauren Fetch. 
Menster in for Minnesota State. Muth comes out for a rest. Barabich comes out for MSU Moorhead. As we said back in the ballgame, Lauren Fetch. Left-hander puts it up, good. Stutley in the lineup for Minnesota State. Tonsfeld with uh, one free throw there. And she is uh, out of the game right now. She has a total of 11, driving uh, to the hoop, short with it, hints the rebound, she misses on the left block. There is a cover on the basket tonight for this uh, number one team in the conference, the Dragons. Stutley drives hard to the basket, off the glass. And I, are you gonna count that? Yes, they are, and she was fouled. Hard drive to the basket by Stutley for her sixth point. And the foul was on Hintz. Check that, Volker. So timeout on the court. The Mavericks lead at 55 to 32. Stutley will go to the line when we come back. 28, 203 left in the third over Upper Iowa. And Crookston down by 13 at Southwest Minnesota State. It's got the half. 44 to 31. All right, Stutley at the line. Shot is up. Nope. short. Comes off, uh, and Stutley gets her own rebound. Out front, Stutley with it. Backs up on the dribble, gets it over to Shumsky in the left corner. Shumsky, cross-court pass, goes to Minster, quickly inside to Drost. Drost on the baseline, looks, moves in, little fade away on the baseline, not good, right into the hands of Hins. That did not hit the rim. Up ahead, it goes to Legal. Legal driving to the left block, and she is fouled. She'll get two. Shumsky, number two on Shumsky. Shot is up, good by Legal. Shot coming up. Made the first one, second one, good again. So Legal gets both of them. Brooklyn Legal, 6'2", sophomore guard. That's right, a guard, no less. Stutley, right wing, drives, kicks it over in the corner, Minster for three, no, rebound. Last touch by Volker, I believe. Double check this here. Legal from uh, Richland Center, Wisconsin. Pass goes into Klitsky. Down the left side of the lane, kicks it back out to Menster. Pull up in the lane, high off the glass, not too good. And uh, not good at all. <laughs> Rebound up ahead to Herbranson. <clears throat> Driving all the way down the left side of the lane. Started that drive out on the right wing, circled around the circle, and uh, Natalie Steichen from Dilworth, Minnesota, Dilworth, Glendon, Felton, is at the line for two. Foul was on Klitsky, her second. Fifty-five, thirty-four. Mavericks on top. Three forty-five to play in the third. Shot is up. Good by Steichen. Uh, that was her first point of the night. Missed the first one, got the second one. Youth driving the baseline. Bounce pass in the lane. Jumper on the way. Not good by Menster. Menster with a good look, good quick uh, pull-up jumper, but it wouldn't go for. Her. 
Lob pass inside to Hins. Whips it out on the uh, right wing. Shot is up. Not good by Herb Branson. Rebound uh, coming up with it is uh, Muth. Fakes left, drives right, gets into the lane, then uh, takes a step up and good. Muth just kept on going with it. Picked up the lay-in. She has five, and she was fouled. Muth at the line. The shot is up. Good. Substitution for the Dragons. 42 to Cole Brown. 58 to 35, 305 remaining. Steichen goes to the left side, kicks it back out front. Volkert down low, banging it off the glass. A little hard there for number 42, Nicole Brown. But Dragons come up with it. Brown gets it back from Steichen, lays it in on the right block. Fifty-eight thirty-seven, Mavericks by twenty-one, two thirty-six remaining. Muth out front with it goes to the left side. Drost, she'll jump it up uh, from the left uh, corner. Not good. Almost steals it away from uh, Steichen. Long pass up ahead here to Volker. She'll take the three. No, gets her own rebound. Looking. 213 remaining in the third. Lobs a pass inside, knocked away by Ashley Reed, and picked up by Tonsfeld. 58 to 37, 202 remaining. Stutley driving to the right uh, baseline, fires it back to Muth overhead on the right wing. So Steichen will bring it up. Goes to the right side. Gives it to Volkert. Volkert on the run, the three, no. Rebound long, comes to Drost at the free throw line. Gives it up to Muth. Muth straight up the center of the court. 140 remaining. Third quarter, Mavericks lead it 58 to 37. Muth driving, gets to the right block, looks, whips a pass over to Ashley Reed. She's fouled, she'll get two. Fifty-eight to thirty-seven, one twenty-nine remaining, and that foul is going to go against uh, legal. That's her first. Ashley Reed shot is up and good. <laughs> Barely rippled the net. That was so dead center. Ashley from uh, Whitefish Bay, Wisconsin. Second shot up and good. Ashley, a uh, senior, 6-2. Steichen over on the right side. Volker down low. Ashley Reed steals it again. That's her third steal. Stops, hands it off to Muth. Muth over in the corner to Tonsfeld to the baseline on the left side, then comes back out with it. Then spins into the lane, off the glass, not good. Rebound, uh, Dross saves it, gives it to Stutley. Out front on the right side to Ashley Reed. Now Muth, 59 seconds remaining in the third quarter. Muth fakes to the left, goes right with it, gets underneath on the block. Off the glass and good. Little mismatch there in size with Steichen. And uh, Muth has had a very good third quarter here with a total of eight. Herbranson, right wing, goes in the corner. Underneath, Volkert uh, fouled by Stutley. Taylor Stutley. Volkert at the line. Shot is up and good. Shumsky back in the lineup. The shot is up. Uh, good. And Volkert. Now with a total of six. Out 
front, Muth. 21 seconds. There's only about a half a second between the shot clock and the game clock. 15 seconds. 13, 12, 62 to 39. Ball knocked away by Volkert. And I think it was off Stutley, however. Yeah, Volkert uh, knocked it away, but Stutley was the one who touched it last. I think inadvertently. I don't even know if she got her hands on it. Volkert, right wing, goes in the corner. Steichen at the buzzer is not fouled. I think they thought she was, meaning uh, the Dragons, but no. So, third quarter, 62-39, Minnesota State on top. Their best performance of the year. They've had three in a row before this. Didn't win them all, but uh, they beat St. Cloud State. They beat Wayne State. Then after controlling 95% of the game, they uh, lost to uh, Augustana number two team in the Southern Division and not a night. They're beating the number one team in the North 62 to 39 going into the final 10 minutes. We'll take a break. Jumper, not good by the Dragons Green. Here's Muth. Tries to get it into Shumsky, knocked away from behind, but Ashley Reed picks it up. Drives to the basket, off the, it's, nope, didn't get anything that time. And the loose ball is picked up by Herbranson. Megan Hintz uh, with 11 rebounds. I think I told you that. Underneath, Hintz with a nice move uh, with the left hand, gets it up and in on the left block. Hintz, it's her first two of the second half, I believe. Here's Muth, spins away from Steichen. Steichen uh, came into the ball game in the third quarter, and she's uh, kind of a mighty bite. Just 5'5", uh, five, five, freshman, in and out. From the free throw line on the jumper. Rebound hands up ahead. Volkert. Volkert cross court here to Herbranson. Almost loses it. Picks it up. Then back out front to Hintz. Hintz has it. Gives it up to Herbranson. The freshman comes to the point. Is fouled by Tonsfeld. Tonsfeld with 11 points. And uh, that is her first personal. Tonsfeld, uh, let me see here. Total of three rebounds, 11 points. Volker from way outside on the right wing. Not good in the rebound, Muth. Muth, uh, one of the best rebounding guards in the conference. Five for her. Muth loses the basket, or uh, Tonsfeld loses the basketball. She, th she thought it was uh, touched by, well, now they're having a conference underneath the basket. I think, uh, I think Tonsfeld just plainly lost it, but we'll see. No. It's going to go to the Mavericks. Baseline right. Youth will toss it in. Pass in goes to Tonsfeld. Tonsfeld across the lane. The jumper rolls off. Not good. Rebound taken down by Hintz. That must be at least 12 now for her in the rebounding department. Inside to Green. We have a whistle. She was fouled. That was on Tonsfeld. Second foul. Baseline right. 
Steichen. Steichen gets it underneath the Volkert and she is fouled. Steichen, just a freshman, good little player. Shot is up by Jackie Volkert, up and good. She has nine. Second shot on the way by Volkert, that's good. In double figures now with 10. Over on the far side of the court, uh, Muth. Had the ball knocked away, but that foul is going to go against Volker for third. Shumsky gets the pass. And we have a whistle there. It's going to go against Moorhead, I believe. It'll go on Hints. On Hints, that is her third. Seven left to go. All right, this is Muth uh, taking the inbound pass from Tonsfeld. Goes to the right wing. Over to Tonsfeld, who is from Moorhead. I think we brought that out in the first half of the game. We're in the fourth quarter now, 7.42 to play. Mavericks lead at 62 to 43. Drost, one of the hottest starts I think uh, any Maverick has had in a couple of years. And she now has 24. But even before the clock started running, I think she had 12. It was ridiculous what she was doing in that first quarter. Tonsfeld uh, at the line. That foul is on Hintz. Shot is up. Not good by Tonsfeld. Hints coming out. Back in the lineup. Peyton Boom. 62-43. to Tonsfeld. Shot is up. That comes off. Rebound. Taken by Green. Here's Boom with it. Oh, <laughs> that was a boom as she knocked Shubsky over. And then the three-pointer is uh, put up and in by Green. I think Boom got away with a, a hit that time, I would say. There's Shubsky off the glass with the running hook. And she's fouled. That was nice. Shubsky at the line, and boom, picking up her fifth. At the line, three Mavericks, shooting one, number 35, Rachel Shubsky. So Shubsky at the line from Grenada Huntley East Chain. Shot is up and in and out. Not good. Rebound, loose ball picked up by Green. I think Green is, yeah, she's playing with three fouls. Over on the right side, <clears throat> with it is Herb Ranson, uh, over here to uh, Volkert, down low to Green, fakes to the left, comes back to the right with the left hand and hits it. Green scoring. Muth up the right side. Goes all the way, nobody picks her up off the glass, she's fouled. Not good, but she is fouled. She'll get two, and the foul is going to go against Brooklyn Legal, her second. So Muth from Cambridge, uh, Wisconsin, is at the line. The shot is up, and it is good. Muth with all of her points now in the second half. That's nine. Her average, we're right around 10 for the season, so she gets this one. She's hit the average, and she does. Substitution for your average, number 20. Muth comes.
comes out 66 to 48. Minnesota State uh, leading with 627 remaining. Here's Steichen to the right side. Little 5-5 freshman guard from Dilworth, Glendon Felton. Volkert for three, skims the rim, not good. Tonsfeld, the rebound, racing up the court. She is going to the baseline, then looks inside, back out front, Drost. Drost backs up on the dribble. Now this is uh, Metzter, loses the basketball. Gulbertson picks it up, gives it off to Steichen. Steichen! going to the basket, popping it up over her shoulder with two hands and gets the basket. She's fouled. Shot is up and that comes off. Rebound Tonsfeld. Steichen with the miss on the free throw. 60. Six to 50, 16 point lead for Minnesota State, 540 to play. There's Menster, pull up jumper on the way, rolls, doesn't go. Gross tries to tip it in, can't do it. Gulbranson with the rebound. She comes up the left side, goes inside the arc and gives it up to Green. Green on the left wing beyond the arc, drives to the baseline, spins in the lane, off, not good. Rebound Klitsky. Klitsky is going to be tied up. Possession goes to Minnesota State. Substitution for Moorhead, number 51, Megan Hayes. Also, the Dragons, 24, Kelly Baravich. Baravich is back in for the. Um, Dragons. Drost will uh, toss it in. Baseline left, gets it in to Klitsky. Klitsky spins, goes to the left side, and we have a whistle. Too long. Too long in the backcourt. 10 second violation. So it'll go back to. It'll go back to the Dragons. Steichen to the right wing. Volker now in the right wing. Volker down low to Hintz and we have a whistle and a foul on Minnesota State. Timeout. Mavericks lead by 16, 66 to 50 with 4.56 to play. Timeout on the court. We'll be back to the state. Steichen wants to pass it in. Better hurry, she does. Gets it over to Legal. Then the Baravitz, uh, her shot is blocked, uh, picked up by Drost. Drost steals it, 66 to 50. Tonsfeld. Left side, Shumsky. Whips a pass underneath, reverse layup, does it go for Muth? Hints with the rebound, up ahead it goes. Jumper on the way, a three pointer, up and good by Legal. 66 to 53 with 417 remaining. Drost has it. Hands it off to Muth. Tonsfeld out front. Back to Muth. Drives into the lane and she walked. So inbounding it. That would be, well, no, we're going to have a foul. Foul's going to go on Tonsville. Baravich hits the free throw. Second shot, up 
and good for Barabic, so she gets them both. Sixty-six to uh, fifty-five. Six points. Minnesota State leading it. Number forty-five, Rachel Shumsky. And it'll be Shumsky at the line for the Mavericks. Sixty-six to fifty-five. Shot is up and good by Rachel. Shumsky with uh, just, well, she has four, that's right. Missed that one. Over the far side, Volkert goes inside and she finds Green there. She drives to the basket and is fouled on the left block. And that's going to go against Drost for first. Shot is up, not good by Green. This will be the 41st free throw shot tonight. Second shot, good. So Green gets uh, one of two. Goes into Shumsky, races up the right side with it, stops. Looks over here to Klitsky. Klitsky apparently walks with it. So it'll go back to the Dragons with 3.33 remaining and the Mavericks leading by 11. Steichen. Getting to the left block, has to kick it back though. Shot is uh, up, not good, misses everything by legal. And we have a whistle. Last touch by the Mavericks, it's gonna go baseline right. On the far side, it's legal. Now Barabic. Long three by Barabic, it's not good. Rebound, however, by Green, and she is fouled. Shumsky with the foul, that is her third. Shot is up, good. Green. Make this a nine point game. This was once a 25 point game with 31 seconds left. 67 to 57, 311 remaining. In and out, not good. Rebound Stutley clears it away, and we have a whistle. Time out. Time out. 67 to 57, a 10 point lead now for Minnesota State with 307 remaining. Here's a final, uh, UMD 80 and uh, Winona State 59 in women's basketball. Here's another one, Sioux Falls 95-47 over Bemidji State. Men's game coming up uh, on the fan, Mankato, and also on the internet. It'll be Drost uh, passing it in. Drost calls a timeout, probably the wise thing to do. So we'll take a break. Mavericks lead it 67 to 57 with uh, 307 to play. Dan Subway has been a problem. 
partner of Maverick Athletics since 1995. Thank you for your continued support. Mavericks, eat fresh at Subway. And fans, Jack Lynch Jerky is a proud sponsor of Maverick Athletics. Jack Lynch, protein pack snack, pack with protein. All right, time back in. Pass in goes to Stutling, Klitschke. Klitschke up the left side with it. Goes all the way to the basket, and I think we're gonna have an offense, no? Foul is going to go against legal. That's uh, her second. Let's get at the line. The shot is up and uh, good. Substitution for the Dragons, 40. Into the uh, lineup. Uh, well, let's see. Uh, first of all, Legal will come out and uh, in is Green. 68 to 57. Klitsky up and good. So Klitschke gets them both. Here's Steichen, then outside, Volkert, Volkert hits a three. 2.49 remaining, 69 to 60. Timeout on the court, Mavericks lead it by nine. Let's see if we have any more finals in women's basketball. Be sure to trust consolidated communications for a win when it comes to your business. Not yet. Uh, a couple of them are getting close, and this one is too. 2.49 to play. We'll uh, take a break. Check out our full lineup at consolidated.com. Muth racing down the court. Lays it up and in, but that's not going to count. Shooting double bonus. Two shots. Number three, Monica Muth. Monica's shot is up and uh, not good. 69 to 60, 245 remaining. Second shot. That is good. Go! 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 So it's 70 to 60, 10 point lead, 239 to play for the Mavericks over Moorhead. Drive to the basket by Steichen, and she is fouled. Following the Mavericks, number three, Monica Mew, second personal. And it'll go. The line for Moorhead, shooting double bonus, two shots. Against Muth. Her second. At the line, Steichen. Shot is up, good. Steichen now with a um, total of three. Up ahead, Klitschke going for the basket, and we have a whistle. Maddie Green! Just plain lost it. Go! Go! Coming up the right side, and Steichen uh, racing up the right side. She's fouled. I think Shumsky. Fourth on Shumsky. Seventy to sixty-one. The Mavericks uh, lead by nine. At one time, they had a twenty-five point lead. Steichen with the uh, basket. 
She now has a total of three. Second shot up and good. In the backcourt, Muth, seven point lead, 2.14 to play. Drost, Drost who uh, was uh, so active in the first half, the running jumper, not good. Rebound taken by Shumsky, back to Shumsky, gets it underneath, then whips it out to Drost for three. That's short. Rebound, Stutley tried to come up with a rebound, couldn't do it. Baravitz comes up with it, off the glass and good. Baravitz scoring. And she was fouled. Muth with the foul. That is her third. Shot is up by Barovitz. And it's good. In the backcourt, foul is going to go against uh, Volkert. Wait a minute. No, no, no. Travel. Travel on Shumsky. Ball goes into Volkert. Volkert backs up on the dribble. And we have a whistle and a foul out front, I believe, on Tonsfeld. Fourth personal on Tonsfeld, 142 to play. Mavericks lead it by four. Volkert at the line, shot is up and good. Now it's a three point game, second shot, good. Volkert gets them both. In the backcourt, Muth with it, 70 to 68. Minnesota State by two. Muth being watched by Steichen. 70 to 68. Muth gives it up. Stutley. Stutley is fouled. Baravich with the foul. That is her fourth. Dudley at the line, the shot is uh, not good. 121 to play, two point game. Mavericks led 40 to 25 at the half and just a couple of minutes ago, they still had a double digit lead. That shot by Studley is up and good. So uh, let's see, she makes one of two. From outside, Barabitz, long three, misses 71 to 68. Moorhead, though, coming up with the rebound. Barovic drives to the basket, tries to hook it up, forces it up, and Stutley takes it away, and then Stutley is fouled. Men's game coming up in the fan. At approximately, well, it won't be 7.30. It'll probably be about a half an hour past that. One minute remaining, 71 to 68. Studley at the line for Minnesota State. Shot is up and... Studley... Gets it. Griffin, 30. Kylie, 23. Next, 32. Second shot on the way. Stutley not. She's not going to get that one. Drost has it. Goes into the lane. Whips it back. Tonsfeld. Tonsfeld gives it up to Muth. Muth has it. Backs up on the dribble. On the left wing. Now goes hard for the basket. Goes over on the right side. Tonsfeld. Whistle before the shot. Steichen with the foul. 
Muth at the line, the shot is up and good. She'll get another one. Second shot, good. And a timeout, 39.7, 74 to 68. We'll take a break. Also fans, Old Dutch has been in business for over 80 years and continues to deliver a one-of-a-kind taste that can be matched. Make sure to pick up a bag or two of Old Dutch snack foods in the Maverick concession stand. Old Dutch, quality in this This is horrible. It's terrible. Ball into Volkert. Volkert goes over on the right side. Out front. Three-point attempt up. Not good. Rebound. Tonsfeld with 28 seconds to play. Long pass up ahead. Menster. Menster. Out front to Muth. Muth spins. Gives it up to Menster. Menster at the point. Goes to the right wing. And we have a whistle. 60 free throws shot in this game tonight. Two shots for Menster. That was a, let's see. Yeah, that was a fourth foul on legal. Shot is up good. Menster. Muth at the line. Second shot up, good by Muth. So Muth gets them both at 76-68. Shot out of the corner, three-pointer. Oh, goodness. Well, she fouled on a three-pointer. I think Studley fouled her on the three. We'll see. Fouling the Mavericks, 23, Kayla Studley, second personal. The line for the Dragons shooting three. Mm -hmm. Five, Brooklyn Weagle. It's three. Legal misses the first. She'll get two more. Shot is up. That one's good. She will get another. Second shot. Third shot. Up and good. So she makes two out of three. And it's a six-point game now. 7.7 7 remaining. Let's see if we have any more finals here. I think we had just about all of them. Concordia St. Paul 71 to 49 over Northern. Sioux Falls, 95-47 over Bemidji State. These are all women's scores now. 80-59, UMD over Winona. That's a final. St. Cloud State defeated Upper Iowa, 69-56. Minot State losing to Augustana. Oh, that got close, 61-58. Cruxton. 3-12 to play, inching ever closer to Southwest. 74-67, Southwest leading. University of Mary, 65-60 over Wayne State. Six seconds to play there. On the far sideline, Stutley will toss it in. And Muth has it knocked away. On the far sideline, Stutley again. 
will toss it in right about midcourt. Gets it in the Drost. Menster, that's it. 76 to 70. Minnesota State wins it. 17 and four now for the league leading Moorhead State Dragons. 13 and two in league play. Mavericks go to eight and 11 overall. And uh, five and 10 in league play. All right, we'll come back and uh, we'll give you all the stats on the internet and the radio. Right now we've got to hook up uh, with the radio for the men's game, which is uh, due to start here. I would say it'd be about 10 minutes to eight uh, before we uh, really get going. All right, we'll take a break. Mavericks win it, 76-70 women's basketball.
Mm-hmm.